right, today I am going through four things that I always keep in my freezer. Why is it such a great tool in the kitchen? Well, number one, I love to buy stuff that I don't necessarily use throughout the course of one week, and I know fresh produce tends to go bad pretty quickly. So I choose to buy frozen because it lasts a lot longer. Number two, a lot of times I prefer to buy organic produce. Versions that are frozen tend to be cheaper than the versions that are fresh. Number three, what did I say was number three? Number three, if you are trying to just throw together something for a lazy last minute meal, the freezer is your place to go. Let's dive in and see what I always keep in there. Number one, organic frozen broccoli. I always keep broccoli in there because as far as vegetables go, broccoli is a lot of bang for your buck. Vitamins, minerals, fiber, protein, antioxidants, anti-inflammatory compounds, I mean, what more can you ask for? Now all you gotta do to use this is zap it in the microwave for 30 seconds to a minute and a half, and you're ready to throw it into a pasta dish on the side with some meat. Super, super easy and a powerhouse nutrition-wise. Number two, organic cauliflower rice. Now this is one that I actually just discovered myself and I am loving it. I call this my sneaky little friend because you can sneak it into so many dishes. It doesn't do much to the flavor. It doesn't do much to the texture, but you're adding a ton of fiber and additional vegetable in throughout the day. So for example, I'll sneak it in when I'm cooking uh, ground meat for tacos or for a pasta sauce. It even can work in smoothies and it's great in oatmeal too. The best part is you don't even have to defrost it. The, the pieces are so small that you can just throw it in with whatever you're cooking and it'll heat up pretty quickly. How much easier can it get than that? Number three. Chicken sausage. I love this brand in particular, Applegate, and their chicken and apple sausage is the bomb. Just my personal preference, but it can be any chicken sausage you like. When it comes to snack and meal time, I always think protein, fat, fiber first. Chip one off, roll it up in a paper towel, stick it in the microwave for one minute, and it's ready to go. Grab that with an apple. I've got myself a nice snack. I have them for breakfast. I seriously have them for lunch and I can have them for dinner. Any time of day, you know you've got a great source of high quality protein that's gonna keep you satisfied and energized throughout the day. Last but not least, number four, frozen organic blueberries. I am a fruit fan. I love all fruits all day, all the time. But a reason I always keep frozen blueberries on hand is because one, they're great in smoothies and great in oatmeal. Two, they're deep in color, which means they're full of bioactive compounds. Three, I know that as far as fruit go, berries are pretty low on the glycemic index, which means they're not gonna send my blood sugar crazy high and then crazy crashing. Great for people like me who like a little something sweet in the morning. Also pretty small, no need to defrost. Just throw them into whatever you're cooking, throw them into smoothie, and you've got yourself a lot of nutrients in a tiny package. All right, so those are the four things that I always have in my freezer. If you wanna learn more information, I've got a ton of cool details on my blog at superdigestible.com. If you thought this was interesting, learn something new, or wanna tell me what you always have in your freezer, drop a comment below. I will see you next time in my kitchen.